Okay, sorry, my mic cut out there. But, um, as I was saying, they put random codes around the map, Twitter, Facebook, and they figured figuring out the code. Um, they said, um, in the text, it actually said at 1600 hours, uh, GMT, I believe, I'm not, I'm not 100% sure, <clears throat> that they would release something. Now, this could be the final trailer for Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. We don't know yet. But we're hoping it is, because this will lead to so many more things, and then we'll actually be able to break down that trailer, and break down everything he says, and we'll actually get an in-depth look before cut, kind of cutscene, like trailer to Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. Now, but this this then again says something really bold about Treyarch. Treyarch, they have already before they're even third and fourth DLC. They have let another gaming corporation, Infinity Ward, put their stuff into their game. Wow. How bold does that make them see? How bold is that? That's just pretty amazing to me. I mean, why? I mean, do you really think you, that you're not desperate? You think that this game's always going to be supreme? It's not. Every, the new Call of Duty, the newest Call of Duty will always be supreme. I can tell you guys that now. I don't know if it'll be like, I don't know, it'd be any person who makes it, as, but I'm just saying, any Call of Duty is probably going to be a Supreme Call of Duty, so they shouldn't be boasting too much or let other people put stuff into their game. I'm just saying. But then again, we are happy that they did this, so I hope y'all did enjoy this video. Like, comment, subscribe, and if they actually do release an easter egg, or I mean, I'm sorry, but a trailer, I will try to post it, break it down for y'all, and do as much as I can. But that this is me, Jetty T, and I'm signing off. Peace out, guys.